Hello. Welcome Kelly Clarkson to the studio. Hello, Hello. Kelly. Hello. Hey, by the way, Amy was sitting in the corner. Tell her what you were practicing before she walked in. Oh, what doesn't... No, no, no. Oh. Hello. Hi, Kelly. Hello, Kelly. Oh, hey, Kelly. <laughs> hi. Hey. Oh, I thought it was my singing, but really, yeah, we were practicing saying hi to you. Don't say we. You were in the corner practicing saying hi because she's a huge, huge fan. So, oh. Me and my sister are both big fans. And she was practicing saying hi to you like you do in eighth grade. You did so well. I would have had no clue that you even knew who I was when oh. I walked in here. Thanks, hi. Oh. What would you settle on, by the way? What you, How'd you say hi to her? Oh, just, I, well, actually, you were introducing us, and then she started talking to Lunchbox. Oh. So I just kind of, like, sat back here and was like, hey. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Hey oh, I'm so sorry. It's okay. Sorry. I'm way over here. Oh, that's horrible. You ready for number two? She wore the shirt because she saw you wear the shirt. She wore the shirt. I haven't even seen this. I know. She, she, has, a dare, she, she has a dare shirt on. I love it. I know. That's I amazing. know. <laughs> oh my gosh. No, I was going to, I thought it was so funny because I wore it on stage one night and my stylist found it because I told her to find a bunch of like vintage t shirts and yeah. she found I actually was a part of Dare when I was a kid. So was I. Yeah. And this isn't from a thrift store. This is actually my shirt from elementary school. Okay, you're way cooler because <laughs> mine totally doesn't fit. So. <laughs> yeah, mine must no. have been a little big on me as a kid, but. Um, yeah, I wore yeah, it. Mine, <laughs> mine was not the mine, but she found it, and I thought it was so funny. So. Yeah. We saw you in it on the boat. Mm -hmm. That's yes, when you wore yeah. it with the black That's, skirt. And she was like, I have one. I've got to save it for Kelly Clarkson <laughs> oh when she comes God, in. Oh, my God, I love it. Mm -hmm. No. Yep. I was used to think it's funny, too, as a kid, because I was like, I didn't know anyone that did drugs, but I knew a lot of people that drank, so I was like... Yeah. Is that just as bad? Like, I remember as a kid going, why is there not a program for drinkers? I don't know. As a kid? Yeah. A kid. yeah. Well, you're, you're there's a, a deep lot of thinking alcoholism kid. in our family, so that's why I was probably thinking about it. But yeah. So, I want to play a little bit of this new song here. Yeah. I love this song. You want to make some babies, don't you? So that's uh, all. Yeah. <laughs> she does. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I love this song. I do not. Not right now. <laughs> so, whenever you pick the song, what are you thinking? Whenever I picked it? No, yeah, when you pick, when it's like, I'm going to sing this one. This is going to be my song. Well, actually, what's funny is we've been, ever since, like, years ago, when I sang with the Rascal Flats, people have been sending me stuff to try and go country, and I'm like, ah, nothing really fit. And actually, one of my friends wrote this, and um, I, I just am a huge fan of his writing, and then I, I love that it sounded kind of old school country, because I think all of us, like, whatever age... You know, wherever music was when you were in junior high, that's like your favorite style of music. I don't know why. For sure. Like the 90s for us. We were all born in the 80s. Yes. So for us, even country, it's like Travis Tritt. Yes. Right. And, he's and I, my favorite That's what male. I always say, too. I always <laughs> reference. Oh, my God. He's so soulful. I Travis can't believe Tritt. you said that. No one says Travis Tritt. I do, always. I'm so impressed right now. Because... Uh -oh. I'm a member of a country, country club. club. Oh Isn't that the gosh. jam? Yes. And yeah. his voice, just so soulful. And the mullet. Well, it kind of defines. Always, there's, that's a whole... Time, yeah. That and the Diamond 90s. Rio. Those were like my two. Diamond Rio. Didn't they have that song, Gone? You're and Gone. Yeah. My jam was Meet in the Middle. I start walking Walk your way. way. Yeah. You start walking mine. Yeah. Yeah. We'll meet in the middle. Need that old Georgia pie. <laughs> you Look you. might want to collaborate Boom. with him. Who wants him? some in this action? <laughs> <laughs> yep, Kelly Clarkson oh does. Oh, my gosh. No, I think, yeah, but 90s, like whatever, wherever you were in junior high, so. So... Vince Gill is like the coolest, though, too. That's why yeah. when I heard it, I was like, because even for us, again, in the 90s, yeah. Vince Gill was such a big deal. Oh, my God. Seeing you with everybody. I'm a huge Vince Gill fan. Did yeah. you sing this in the studio with him or did you guys sing it separately? Honestly, no. We It was a long shot. I didn't know he was going to say yes. Like, so you we, have to ask, you asked him? Yeah, yeah, well, we were recording Don't Rush, Dan Huff and I, and, and he said, what do you want to do with the background vocals? And I was like, well, actually, I love, like, my favorite thing about country is all the collaborations, and I thought it might be cool like, I know back in the day, like, Vince Gill used to do all those backgrounds for, like, Trisha, Reba, like, all those, and also duets. So it's like, he was just the guy that had that, you know, buttery voice that went with everyone. And and I was like, do you know him? <laughs> I was like, could you get him to see on this? And, and Dan asked for me, and I was literally on my way to Australia when I landed in Australia and found out that he had said yes and was going to do it. He did it in his own studio at his house, his, his part. But uh, the first time we sang it was on the CMAs. Really? So yes. were you nervous singing God, with Vince Gill? I had two shots of Jack. I'm not kidding. <laughs> I don't get nervous singing, but I get nervous when I when I I'm like really wanting to impress someone, and and I'm singing with Vince freaking Gill. So I'm like, I, if I suck this up, I'm not, I'm I'm gonna hate myself for the rest of my life. So anyway, yeah, I had two shots of of Jack, and and he was really nice and kind of talked me off the ledge while we were <laughs> right before the wall went up. How long before though did you have your shots before you performed? Did you give it 20 minutes, or did you take them right before you walked out? 
Uh, probably like ten minutes. Yeah, just yeah. just to and have it was enough actually, time. I didn't even have it. I was just my uh, uh, the girl that was actually singing back up with us on stage. She actually is on the record as well. Um, she literally was like, "Do you need some? Do you need some Jack?" And I was like, "Maybe, yeah." That would be a good. Usually, I don't, but yes, at this point, yes. <laughs> so I was very nervous. Well, we're gonna play the single right now. Okay, cool. Kelly Clarkson in the studio here on the Bobby Bone Show. Woo! Clap your hands, and here it is right now.